So we're going to do a oil change, filter change on a 2019 Dodge Caravan. And over here, so I'm using a synthetic oil, Mobile One, and uh, the requirements are a 5W20, okay? And so this is the Mobile One uh, filter cartridge that we're going to be changing with, the M1C456. Okay, so this is the oil fill right here. We're going to remove this cap. That's where we're going to put our oil to fill it up. And then here, underneath the, uh, the air hose vent is where the oil filter is. So we'll have to get here. That's either 24 mil or you can get away with a 15 16th socket. But to get uh, access to that, we need to remove this cover. There's three clips, one, two, three. And we'll just push that out of the way, which will allow us access to there. Okay, so I just removed the cartridge. And you can see the difference between the new and the old. So in the new system, you do get a new gasket, so we're gonna have to replace the O-ring gasket right here and replace the filter. So again, just take note where the O-ring goes. It's right on that lip right there. Don't push it all the way to the main. Okay, so now we have our filter assembly. Again, uh, this is, you wanna make sure you don't cross thread, so just hand tighten it. Make sure you got the threads in. And then we're gonna use our 24 mil or 15 16 socket to snug it up. And then once we're done that, reassemble our air filter system with the clips. Next, uh, put uh, the car on jacks or a hoist or a lift. So we're gonna get access to the uh, oil pan underneath. And then you're gonna need a either half inch socket or a 13 mil socket. Location of oil pan is right here under the passenger side. There's the wheel there. That nut there. It's a 13 mil or half inch. Doesn't take much, just crack it a bit. And then the rest is going to be done by hand. Just make sure it's on the oil pan. And you have a couple rags to clean up. Okay, once it's stripped out, you can clean it up on the rag. Make sure your, uh, your fitting is good. Yeah, it's essentially you don't uh, cross thread this, just hand tighten it. Okay, and then get your wrench. That's it. Quarter turn. Clear up. Wipe nice and clean. And we'll go up top, put some oil in. Okay. So next we add the oil. Okay, so fill up a good portion of the oil. And then what we're gonna do is take the van, put on a level surface, turn the engine off, let it set for about five, 10 minutes, and then check the uh, dip scale oil scale and see where we're at and if we can add add some more oil to it okay so next we want to get rid of the oil change oil sign and the manual says how to do this so what we want to do is so turn the ignition key to the on position do not start the engine and then slowly depress the accelerator all the way to the floor three times all within 10 seconds then turn the ignition key off, lock position, and then we start the vehicle. So it should reset 